Hey Cameron, it's time. You can't avoid me any longer. It's time to play some War Machine. That's right. I'm pretty, I'm really quite sick of your smug, self-righteous attitude. Like you think you're better than everyone just because your army looks better and you've played all these games. Uh, yeah, I, I know I can beat you, Cameron. You Don't ignore me, Cameron. I know you can hear me. Sorry, what? Oh, uh, you want to play some War Machine? Yeah, yeah, I can do that. Okay. Hey, I'm here with my buddy Mike. Look hey. at this. He doesn't, he doesn't believe I can do eight videos a day. But guess what? I'm counting this as one. Hey. Hey, hey, Blue Table fans. It's time for a War Machine Hordes bat rep. And I do mean in that order because I'm playing Rin with his Kador Force. That's War Machine. Me, Circle of Orberos, that's Hordes. And here's the battlefield. This is a three foot by four foot table. We are going to reduce the deployment zones down to four inches so there will be appropriate amount of space between the forces. Uh, many of you will recognize this terrain set. It's been in the studio for quite a while. It is an Orberos themed set I did back in, I do believe, 08. And I love it. I can't bring myself to get rid of it. Uh, we have uh, mostly impassable stuff here. here. Uh, obstructions, those are called. And we have some terrain uh, forests, which is rough terrain. Uh, you can only see through three inches of forests. So this guy cannot see this guy right there. No line of sight. But if he's around the edge here, you'd have to measure to see if three inches of forest are intervening. So there's that. And here's what I have in my army. I have um, um, Kaya Moonhunter and Laris, her animal companion. That's negative three points. I have three wolves, war wolves. Those are one point each, so that evens out. I'm at zero. I'm taking a gnarl horn satyr, that's what I'm calling this thing, and in fact it's quite apropos with the horned helmet and all. Isn't that fantastic? A pure blood warp wolf, and two warp wolf stalkers, and that adds up to 37 points. And I'm just going to have Ren meet me at whatever points I happen to have. I've been expecting you, Mike Dunn. So, what's new in Dunn land? Duntopia. Duntopia. Mikeville. Uh, a lot of working and yeah. not as much playing as I would like. Because people miss you. They want to know what happened to you. Yeah, I'm still alive. Um, just been you working. know what? Just stop. Just stop. He's a corporate sellout. That's what he is. He left the job he loved and wanted to do for the money. For the money. So what do you do again? <laughs> yeah, uh, I teach. Oh, no okay. Money. But um, I presume you don't love it. I do love it. Oh, dang it. Yeah, All that's right. the thing. Um, yeah, so I teach and I game on the side. Okay, great. But right now, there's just been too much teaching and not enough gaming. But I have gotten into Infinity. And right. I really like that game. Um, probably, well, I go in phases, but right now I do like it more than anything else. Really? Yes. Okay. Um, so tell us about it. I think the reason I like it is because it has that war machine feel where everybody has like a personality like it's not just this okay. mass of zombies or space marines or whatever 120 orcs yeah there's like six guys uh, i love the 120 orcs okay but go ahead no, I, I think well I think you know we, just, we, we were setting up a lot of that and now i'm kind of into right. something else okay right now. no that that's good um that's good. but i really like it like one change of of you swap out two of your regular like rifle guys for machine gun guy and it totally changes the dynamic of your force uh, and I like it a lot. So it's like a small scale special ops type of yeah. thing. Right. Yeah. Like you might have 12 guys on the side, but that'd be like a lot of guys. Um, it took me a while to get into Infinity because 
I looked at the rule book like two years ago or something and I just couldn't figure it out. Like I, I just opened it up and there were all these different terms and it wasn't like anything else that I'd played. And I didn't know anybody who played it and so I just started reading, got through two pages, closed it and didn't touch it for a while. Um, then I found out uh, that it's really not that difficult. I went to um, infinitythegame.com. They have a download section. All their rules are online. And they worked with Beasts of War to make... Uh, it's like oh, five like how to. Or something. Yeah, it's like right. a five-page little PDF. Of okay. Here's everything that's simplified. Um, and I read that in like ten minutes. And I just got some, like a Space Marine and a little Tau guy and set them up and just had them shoot at each other. And it's really an easy game. It just, it's really complicated on the surface if, if you're coming in from the outside looking at right. it. Right. But it's really But if someone simple. explains it to you. Oh, yeah. It takes like two seconds to see how it works. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah. Maybe you'll have to come down and show us how it's done. Have a little demo. Yeah, that'd be fantastic. Okay. You got you guys all painted up, right? Uh, almost. Oh, <laughs> uh, my. Maybe some work. But, how uh, far you have fallen. Yeah. It's all right couple of days. See, now I'm motivated to do it. Oh, good. Plus yeah. I have See, all you need so to do is yeah, be in my days. general vicinity and uh, you get inspired. <laughs> yeah. It's fantastic. Yeah. It's a true story. All right. So, there you go. Oh, uh, what about the pies? Oh, um, it's a holiday. Yeah. So, my wife's baking. Uh, she's making pies and cheesecakes for yeah. Thanksgiving. Cheesecake sounds good right we now. We should... Let's see. Thanksgiving, we'll probably have uh, three cheesecakes and at least three pies in my fridge. Um, I don't think nice. any of those will survive to the, to see Saturday. Right. You're seriously? You're gonna just sit down and eat a pie? Well, we'll have family. You a stuff. fork and the pie. Um, that's my. Because that's what I would do. That'll be my birthday. I'd be thing. like, what are the rest of you gonna eat? <laughs> Yeah, that's happened before. One time yeah. we had... So, hold on. At least once in your life have you sat down and ate a whole pie? Uh-huh. Now, do you, well, eat too? do you eat the crust, too? Yeah. Do you eat the crust? I don't eat the very top of it, like the part that gets burned and stuff when it's Oh, okay. Right. I, that's no, yeah, that's it's gross. It's like a crouton. Right. But I eat the rest of it. Okay, good. I usually don't feel good. You know what I like to do is keep a whole thing of whipped cream <laughs> and just keep putting whipped cream on it. That's gross. And, oh, yeah. It depends what it is. So delicious. I'll do that with, with like, pumpkin pies or pumpkin cheesecakes. Anything else I don't like. Pumpkin pie. cheesecake? Pumpkin cheesecake is pretty good. That's a real thing, huh? Uh-huh. Do you All want right. me to bring you some? I would love anything. <laughs> okay. Anything with cheese and cake. Yeah. And I love both of those things. That's fantastic. Yeah, that's pretty good. I'll bring some down. All I'll right. bring some down, and we'll do an infinity demo. Okay, so when are you going to be down? Um, today's Wednesday, today's Saturday. Wednesday. I'll be here Saturday. Okay. Why don't you email me the time? All right. All right. Don't Maybe flake Friday, out on me. Friday or Saturday. One That's of those fine. Two. I'll be here Not Friday. Sure. Okay. Okay. Great. We'll do. It's a uh, date. Th- oh boy. <laughs> we can't end on that note. Oh no! I think I think it's happening. <laughs> All right. So I'll see you guys Friday uh, when I'm having my mandate. Apparently. With uh, with Mike Dunn, oh. <laughs> Mike's like. I'll make right. sure I shower for that. Oh, okay, good. Uh, yeah. Oh, and by the way, we are open. We are open. I'm available. I'm on deck, online, on Thursday. That's Thanksgiving Day. Yeah, I'm not some government employee that gets holidays off. Yeah, laugh it up, teachers' You're union not the boy. Office. That's right. And Friday will be a regular working day here, and uh, I will be in on Saturday doing bat reps and stuff. So by all means, means make my holiday, make it bright, and order something or buy something. Yep, there you go. It never ends. It never ends.